Hello, baseball fans, and welcome. The show brings you a matchup of division rivals. The Atlanta Braves going up against the New York Mets. Ladies and gentlemen. All right, we'll be back to your, get this one started New after this. Your Mets. Now in for the Braves, Gerald Raymond. There's a buzz in the stadium every time he comes to the plate as he tries to extend his hitting streak. Hey, let her rip, let her rip. And first offering is fouled off. See you drive it like you can. Let's go. Swing, and that ball is crushed on its way and out of here. And there it is. He stands alone as Major League Baseball's home run king. I never thought I'd see anyone get close to this record. He's a once-in-a-lifetime player, and this is a moment baseball fans across the globe will never forget. They might just build him his own wing at the Hall of Fame in Cooperstown. A legend the likes of which the sport of baseball has never seen. And even though the anticipation has been building for some time now, knowing that this day was going to come, it doesn't take away from the moment one bit. An outpouring of emotion on the field, in the stands, and I'm sure from everyone watching at home as well. It's up there with all of the sport's greatest achievements. DiMaggio's hit streak, Ripken's consecutive games, you name it. This one might top them all. And yeah, the batter now, Gerald Raymond, the top hitter in the National League any entering the day. Any way you can. Here we go. Oh, now this is blasted way back there on its way. Gone. He sends one out the opposite way. He's done it again. His second homer of the game. And they jump out front. It's 4 2. Singing, he's been red hot. Yeah, another big swing of the bat for him. Man, he is really seeing the ball well in this one. That's the exact definition of hitting the ball where it's pitched, taking that outside fastball and driving it the opposite way out of the ballpark. You want to bottle that type of approach. So now to the plate for Atlanta, Gerald Raymond. Sing, you talk about a guy that has all the skills the range is really good, but the arm just stands out, and he makes all the plays. Bounced up the middle, and it's through for a hit. Tejada, rounds third, headed for the plate. He scores, and they have the lead. It's 5-4. Well, that started and ended pretty quickly. No messing around right there. Couldn't get any air under it, but he smoked that ball back up the middle. Timing was just perfect. Got great wood on it, and... There's just no chance for the infielders with how hard he hit it. And now they've got some speed on first, so we'll see if they try to get him into motion. Luis Arise stands in. Here's a 1-1. One -one. Rudder takes off. They pitch out. And that's a stolen base, not even close. Well, I'm sure they're pretty frustrated. They guessed right on the pitch out. The throw was okay, but they still couldn't cut him down. Aside from a bad jump, they stood no chance at catching him right there. On, big guy get your pitch huh on the ground sneaks through base head right past his coach headed for the plate the throws <laughs> offline he's safe and it's 6-4 that's back-to-back -back singles for him just one of those seen eye base hits through the infield he just kind of rolled over on it a little bit but sometimes those can find a hole and get you a knock Gerald Raymond getting ready to hit. 
He's not going to get cheated up there. No, he's not. He's looking to do damage with every swing he takes. Come on, kids. See and drive. Well, it doesn't get much easier with this next batter, but I totally understand going with the intentional walk in that spot. He's just too dangerous at the plate right now, and there's a base open, so it gives you options defensively to get an out. Toussaint pick off, throw to first. Another throw over. Yeah, they're keeping him close. First and third, one down. Runner on the go. That's in for a strike. Throw save. That's a stolen base. Well, you can't fault the defense for not paying enough attention. They threw over a few times, but he just waited it out, kept his timing. He was able to swipe the bag. Nice job of base running right there. Two-two. Foul ball there. Well, he knows they don't want to give him anything to hit, but when you've got opportunities to drive in runs, you've got to expand the zone. He's capable of going out there and doing damage with it. Stays alive. There you go, left fly. That's a bullet, but it goes foul. Hayes, the runner at third. Raymond at second with one away. And a foul ball, he stays alive. And a pitch. On the ground, out to short. And they got him. Good sinker low in the zone right there and produced exactly what he was looking for. Ball on the ground, nice ground out. And up to the plate comes Cody Bellinger, a guy who makes an impact not go. just at the plate, but also in the field. Wait for a good one. Drive it, kid. Ball to strike. Kind of goes without saying, but nope. stranding these two runners in scoring position right here, it feels like it's a must if they stand a chance to win this game. Hey, kid, two outs, it. It. two like in scoring position. Go. And down on strikes he goes. And that is that. Two left for Atlanta. They still lead it though, 6 4. Seventh inning stretch. One out, base is empty. Stepping in, Gerald Raymond. Let's go. This Here guy has go. turned into a beast. And here it comes. Tapped at the plate, but it's a foul ball. Okay, let's scan, let's scan. One down, base is empty. And ball one. Well, pretty clear to me, he was trying to go deep right there, but you got to get a pitch that you can handle. Swing and a ball lifted in the air, shallow left field, base hit. So they get a man aboard with a one out single. Oh, this has been a really nice game at the plate for him. He looks locked in. That's a ball that a lot of times you'll see the shortstop or left fielder be able to get to if it hangs up in the air long enough. But right there, it just died and found a way to drop in on the green stuff for base hit. Luis Arias, next up for the Braves. Right guy, right the tying run at the plate. 
And there he goes. Blocked by the catcher. And he steals second base without a throw. Hey, right guy, right place. The Nobody count two down. and one. High fly ball, pretty well struck out towards right center. That's back. And that one is gone. He blasts one out to right, and we are starting over. It's 8-8. Eight, eight. Knew what pitch he wanted to hit, spit on some other pitches in this at bat, was very patient, and it paid off. Man at first with one gone, Gerald Raymond. Next up for the Braves. Great speed and great power, a great athlete, quite simply. When you have a real athletic player and who's able to do the baseball mechanical things really well look out because the go. sky's look the limit on that potential and that one hammered this one's got a chance pulls it in on the warning track Well, I love the fact they didn't quit. They had to do a little extra work tonight to secure this win, but it's what you got to do over the course of a season if you want to be a championship ball club. A 12 8 final score in this one. And the road team picks up the win and picks up a sweep. For Chris Singleton and our entire crew, I'm John Chomby saying so long.